Every day, human beings are tasked with making important life decisions. And there are oftentimes a variety of factors that we take into consideration when this occurs. Some of these considerations might include a person's goals and values, potential consequences, risks, rewards, emotions, benefits, and other alternatives to the situation as well. However, our reasoning can be redirected sometimes, and nearly all of these factors can become irrelevant in the face of something like peer pressure. This forces us to consider the ways in which peer pressure can influence an individual's decision making throughout their life. Society's viewpoint can assume control over anyone's decision making process, and these opinions can become dangerous for anyone who has an over reliance on these things. This can raise numerous emotional, mental, and even physical concerns because an individual dependent on approval from their surrounding environment can develop unhealthy attitudes, behaviors, and habits. On the other hand, a person's ability to oppose the popular majority can be seen as a display of courage and serve as inspiration for others that surround them. And it is necessary that we consider the common tendency to base our every action on those of the rest of the world that we see. Within people shifting perspectives is the conflict of individual versus society, which explores the ways in which a person's wants and needs go against those of their community by either rebelling or conforming to public standards. Take for instance, Simone Biles. Simone Biles is stardom. As a world-renowned Olympic athlete, she is under immense pressure to compete at her very best every single day of her life and performance. With that being said, she encounters the difficult task of choosing to follow what the world and media expect of her, or rather what she believes is best for her own well-being. When Biles withdrew from the gymnastics team final in Tokyo in 2020, accepting that she wasn't ready to compete was daring, and she did it for her own health and safety. In doing so, Biles displayed courage and vulnerability, but it ultimately led her to face opposition from everybody watching her, whether it be her own family, her friends, or the entire globe watching her on TV. The combination of social tensions and unstable health surrounding Biles' career was enough for her to drop out, but she received backlash because of it. Biles refused to be influenced by others' opinions in this situation, and her reputation was altered from that point on. It is important to note that there can be circumstances that encourage peer pressure in a more positive light as well. The short story through the tunnel The short story through the tunnel follows a young boy named Jeremy and observes how follows a young boy named Jeremy and observes and follows how he observes a much older group of French boys successfully locate and swim through an underwater underwater tunnel. The story essentially tracks Jeremy's progress in making the same daring attempt as well. Many of the obstacles Jeremy faces include fear, doubt, anxiety, nature limitations, and physical injury as well. Jer Sorry. In order to reach the end of the tunnel, Jeremy practices breath control and even sustains a number of nosebleeds. Jeremy's eagerness to prove himself to others was the result of the emotions he experienced throughout the process, and it proved to be a healthy form of motivation because it actually helped him accomplish his goal. Peer pressure does not stem from just a, sim a single group of people, however, and it is frequently found in places such as in the media, in our jobs, and in schools, and especially from even our friends and family that we find in our own homes. A study from South Korea addresses how unrealistic beauty standards and body image issues have become increasingly prevalent in their society. This discovery was made in early school age children, especially females between the ages of five and six, based on their own weight and body dissatisfaction. However, it should come as no surprise that in knowing this, that these concerns are associated with the Korean pop, music, and TV culture that many of them are exposed to on a daily basis. Additionally, researchers took 1,500 high school students from 12 different education systems in the country of Turkey, and they observed how their reactions to their social groups and academic surroundings contributed to their psychological development. An important piece of data to identify from the study is that as peer pressure increases, perceived school life and quality of life increase as well, and vice versa. Using the information from the school and social groups experiment can add to the idea that positive attitudes academic performance, security, and confidence all have a direct relation to a student's sense of belonging and their quality of life. When someone's feeling mistreated or inferior to others, peer pressure may cause them to have a serious lack of acceptance and incentive in their academics, relationships, and motivation to promote their own self-image. There are no limitations to peer pressure as it can occur at any age or any moment in anyone's life, whether it be their young adulthood or even when they're older. 
The majority would suggest that they experience it most during the young adulthood, but it can also be an issue for some as they continue to grow up. For example, the article Moral Courage and Intelligent Disobedience, written by Ted Thomas, identifies the which an officer in the military must know the importance of disobeying either unethical or even illegal orders that might bring harm to a mission. Although it may cost an individual their job, reputation, or other consequence, it is necessary that a person recognize when to fight for their opinion, and either opposing or conforming to social influences. Acting, acting on one's values can sometimes be difficult due to fear of ridicule, rejection, and even loss of social standing, particularly because organizational culture and operational pressures can sometimes cause the value of people to become blurred. Knowing when to oppose the hierarchy takes bravery, confidence, and certainty which are things that are hard to acquire in such a critical environment, especially in something such as the military. The doubt, anxiety, frustration, and confusion that is produced as a result of adherence to communal norms can be damaging if one is not making choices for their own benefit in these situations. Peer pressure is caused by a variety of aspects in one's life, and it can oftentimes be due to personality trait that is triggered. For instance, an investigation was performed in 2014 that focused on individuals who display per perfectionist traits, are sensitive to reject rejection, and desire validation. In order to gain certain information on this behavior, the completion of a variety of tests indicated a strong connection with all of their perfectionism measures. The findings of this experiment suggest that a person strives to prove themselves to the act of being perfect, which could mean that they fall victim into doing things that others might expect of them. Peer pressure surrounds us throughout every stage of life, and it encourages us to either stay true to ourselves or follow the crowd. Although there are a number of negative concerns regarding the impacts it has, positive influence is also an outcome of being open to public opinion, and it is not something that we should disregard as well. Social influences tend to force people into conforming to cultural expectations, and the type of change it can bring about is dependent on the motive behind the action. Peer pressure is about getting the right balance between being yourself and fitting in with your desired group in your social environments. If either one of these begins to take over the other, it causes an individual's own ideas and viewpoints to become distorted. It is crucial that we recognize excessive dependence on the world around us, but we must also consider the ways in which it can help us be courageous and build ourselves up by standing for what we believe in. Thank you. Uh, a couple of questions. Um, how did your research question evolve as you moved through the research process? I would say initially at the beginning of my research, I feel like I had a very narrow view and I had only considered peer pressure in more of a negative sense. But as I explored it more, my question was more focused, like I said, on peer pressure, but I included the idea of peer pressure and disapproval from others to really focus on the negative and positive aspects of it because that was something that became really relevant, I feel like, in recognizing that peer pressure can also be seen in a more positive light. So that definitely changed everything. Okay, thank you. Um, what additional questions emerged from your research and why are they important? Um, I feel like for me a big question was that transition of what you originally thought and kind of what influenced it, like the question of why, like why would someone make this decision? So for a lot of people it was either the idea of being accepted in society and even as I mentioned the idea of it being like a characteristic trait, a lot of us may not even possess that, but the idea of all of us strive to be accepted by others, but we also fear rejection and ridicule and kind of analyze, again, like analyzing that why, of like why do people make these decisions? So that was definitely a question that I explored. Okay, thank you. 